Yo. <clears throat> Yo, what's up, guys? <clears throat> so, basically, I found this, uh, Girl Tech copy that has tons of cool stuff. Like, it is literally the best. I'll be showcasing everything inside the game, including this mod menu, and how to get this Only Up badge right here, and then the hat, and, like, the golden cosmetics and stuff like that. Alright, so, yeah, let's get into it. So, basically, right there, I was just using the camera mod. The camera mod works really good. So, hold on, I'm gonna just place it down. There. There. <clears throat> Alright, so, there's this mod menu that gives you, it's it's a He's Hacker OS, but it's made by Leprechaun. So, it's, there's got flaw, and they do work here. All, all Every single of these work. Platforms, RGB plats, long arms work. It's a little bit bug because it's down here, but there are better long arms coming. Uh, and it's in the page two of this. Uh, Mosa speed, which basically just gives you Mosa settings. Uh, there's player IDs, which basically put, I don't think you can see it on here, but there, it puts like a player ID above their head. So it's like their name and then their player IDs down there. And then there's no tag freeze. And then on page two, there are steam long arms, which are these. They are really good. So your head's not messed up, but your controllers are like way down here. My controllers like in real life is like right here. So it's like basically just having sticks kind of, but just better. And you can also equip the long arms with this and make them even longer. So you're like as tall as like stump now inside of it at least. But yeah, that's pretty cool. But there is a glitch with this one. Maybe finally. Uh, with the steam long arms, where you can't take it off for some reason. You can also get <laughs> short arms. But you, if you put on the steam long arms with it, you can go speeding fast. Like that. Kind of makes you... But you do look, look, look you do look pretty goofy. Look at the heads up here. It's just like... Ling. And then, alright, turn that off. It's got ESP, which basically puts a block on people. And you can stand on, like, the player. Low quality is trash. Turn on SPN for that to go back. Water bending works. This is the water bending. Uh, it is client sided though, so you don't annoy people with it, or people don't annoy you. So yeah, that is the con menu. You press menus up here. Go to Shiba Dark. It's got fly, and um, all of these do work. Like I said, long arms. Oh crap. The long arms works, most of the settings, there's more, more player IDs, uh, low quality SPE, so it's like, and there's got yeah, Day RTX, and this looks beautiful. Here's the Day RTX, and they also have it on the keyboard, which I'll show later. So you got all this. Here's the Night RTX, the Night RTX is my favorite. It makes everything like bluish, and it lights up, has like good shadows. Punch mod, up and down, disconnect, I'm not going to press disconnect. Okay, and then we got Shiba Gold menu, which you press, uh, no, you press, B, you press, uh, A on your right hand controller. And it's called up and down, low quality, rotate platforms, car monkey, slide control, long arms, invisible plats, and slip slap. <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, that's all for the mod menu. And then, and then, uh, there is a custom wardrobe. You can change what you look like. I know it's bugged because I'm in like a... If you're in an infection lobby and you're tagged, it like glitches out. But like there's a hacker OS one. You can go RGB. Uh, you can just go full blue. You can go camo. You can go that kind of camo. That's pretty much all. You can press on mod menus right there. There's mats and there's custom hats too. So I can't get off longer, but you can see there's a crown on my head right there. A nacho hat. A blue thing that goes in your face for some reason. There's a detective hat, and there's a builder hat. But you, uh, these are client sided, I think. So yeah, and then like the best thing in my opinion, there's a holdable pad. So if you press the B controller when you press holdable pad, you press A on your right hand controller. It's left holdable pad. There is a a sight. So you can yeah, there's like a dagger. It's pretty cool. And then, you can remove it by up here. And then, there's stick. But these cosmetics are client-sided. 
if you see somebody with a stick, like you can actually personally see their stick, then they are a real moderator. And like the owner actually does play this game a lot. I've seen them like lots of times. But yeah, you can get the stick for free. Press remove. And then there's a Krabby Patty, which is really cool, in my opinion. Like, you would have a Krabby Patty in your hand. And then remove that. And there, that's all for the holdable pad. And then you just press normal wardrobe. You go back to your normal wardrobe. So, yeah. And then how to get the only up badge. You basically go to game mode. You want to press on your game modes. You want to press enable. And it disables all your um, mods, like platforms and stuff, except for the Steam Long Arms for some reason. So, yeah, you can complete this with Steam Long Arms. And it goes all the way up there past the sky barrier. Not sky, but like the... <coughs> <coughs> Sorry, my throat was logged. <coughs> yeah. So, yeah, and then we disable that. You gain all of it back so it doesn't reset. The FOV can change like the FOV too. And then hold down B on your controller and this happens. So yeah, it's really good. I like it. This is a custom map. Basically, you like touch it with your hands. Put you in this custom map and then get out of it. You want to go over here. So this part is uncollidable for some reason like the rug. So you're going to go here. Put your hand right here. And then you will go back into the lobby, and it's in the Christmas update because the and then like it's got these, uh, from like the old gorilla tag. So yeah, and the computer's really cool. Uh, those are like modded codes. If you play the computer, there's this. It plays like a funny monkey video, and then there's this. You can put space in your name. Uh, you can put fifteen. You can put one. You can put an at symbol and underscore. <clears throat> and there's also an RTX on the computer, also, so that's pretty cool. <clears throat> and then the cosmetics are in here. And sometimes every update, he hides cosmetics around the map where you can go find. Okay, so there is a player model. Nacho's engine's coming very soon. See, it doesn't work right now. But, yeah. So, this is a custom cosmetic. It's three hats in one. All these are pretty much gold and silver cosmetics. So, the pan hat is gold. Cookies are gold. Plunger's gold. Those have been gold, except for those two, like the wrenches. Then it has an archive section, which is pretty cool. You can get turkey leg... Gold, there's where you get the golden hat, and this is where I got my RGB hat from. Is that where, if you're wondering, uh, the gold teeth are from the vampire set right there? Yeah, there's you can be canine, I guess. So, yeah, it doesn't have competitive if you want competitive, but there are scrims. You can sign up for a scrim team in the Discord in this, and I will. And then, how you get this game is go to and make make sure you have like actually it's on side quest it's called project con like like this hold on it's called project con reboot if you want to put that in like that but it'll be in my discord server also so i can just put it in my discord server for y'all and i guess you, you start off with a hundred thousand shiny rocks and then over here is really cool there he made custom customized pins you can be your whole body can be rgb you can get a hacker on your belly your ears and belly can be RGB, which that one I do have. And he's going to add some more because like, you can see those right there. So, yeah. But besides that, this game is really cool. It's even got uh, this right here. There you go. All right, got all those. And there is right now... There is a 2022 glasses that, like, are there the glasses, and they are hidden somewhere around the map, and I still am trying to figure where that is out. And if you get that, you're pretty much the luckiest player, and you no, know, you'll probably never see anyone else with it. And then Finger Painter, you be a content creator, boost Discord two times, I think I've already said that, though. So, 
We've got can canyons and caves. So that's pretty cool. And then, yeah, so that's pretty much all for this amazing game. Y'all should go play it. It's in my Discord. I'm pretty sure you should go to my About section. Yeah. And make sure you do not go modding in private, I mean, in public lobbies, because you will get banned. See, do, there's the rules. Do not be toxic or racist, sexist to anyone. Do not abuse mods in pubs, see? Infection lobbies, if they are mod, that ruin the game for lag. Uh, Yeah, like, I mean, tag, not lag. Uh, you cannot fly, you cannot use plats, no clip, and etc. If someone says they're a moderator, they would have the stick or mod moderator name tag. Not all mods and admins are coners like pulling things out due to drawing attention. If you don't think they are a staff, please report it to the Discord, Project Con Discord. So basically, the only mods you can use in public lobbies is every single long arm. Uh, most of the settings, player IDs, and Nox tag free. I mean, no tag freeze. And water bending, ESP, and punch mod. Those are like the only things you can use. So yeah, I got the RTX right here. Here's the day RTX. It's really cool. Alright, let me see if I can find the night RTX. Is there is a night RTX? I'm pretty sure it's one of the different menus. Hold on. Is it in the sheep of gold? It's in the sheep of dark. Okay, here we go. Day RTX. It gives you the day RTX. Night RTX. Turn day RTX off. And it gives you... Sorry, that was my little brother. Uh, And then... There's like, yeah, it makes it look like this pretty much. So, yeah, that's pretty much everything for this game. It is probably the best Girl Attack fan, I mean, Girl Attack copy. It's better than Girl Attack itself, to be honest. Like, it's literally the best. It's better than Seabus, better than I, I played this game 24 7. And if you're very active and have tons of reports in the game, like people using DLLs and stuff. Uh, then you report that to the Discord, take a picture of their ID, or just report them, and if you play a lot, you can be a trial mod. <clears throat> if you get 14k views on, like, a game, on this game that you make on YouTube, you can get Project Con Discord, I mean, the, yeah, the content creator badge, which is the finger painter. So, yeah, which is, I'm trying to get this finger painter, so I need 4k views on this, so I can get the finger painter, so... And peace, guys. Please like, subscribe, and thank you for 1K. I will be making a 1K thank you video. So, yeah, see you.